everybody. How are y'all? Welcome, welcome. Let's do some sound checks. Hello. How is everybody? I uh, have a directional microphone and the music may be too loud, so we can always bring that down. Uh, and you can get my voice just a little bit better and we'll get started. So glad that everybody's here. Hey Mo, thanks for joining. Always good to chat with you. Uh, we talk so much on Insta, but now it's nice to talk here too. All right, let's bring that music down a little bit so y'all can hear just a little bit better. Hey everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. So glad to have everyone here. Um, definitely have a lot going on as usual. So I'm so excited because we get to uh, we get to do some different things tonight. Uh, look at that. Julie is going to be featured just a little bit later. I will uh, let you know when that's coming up. Julie, don't worry, we're not throwing to you live or anything. But you are going to be mentioned a little bit later tonight, which I'm super excited about. Holly, stay tuned because you, my friend, are also going to have a fun a little feature in just a few minutes. So I'm wanting you to stand by for that as well. Um, I need to go ahead and pour my little cocktail. I am doing something super simple. Sprite, lime, and uh, some Cheetos vodka. That's it. Nothing fancy. I'm so glad to have everybody joining. Hi, Carol. Always appreciate your support. Good to see you. Cheers. Um, can I get a... Um, great, Wendy. That makes me feel good. Looks like maybe I am getting my act together with this by now. So yeah, let's just keep commenting on the sound for just a second, um, just to make sure that I am following along and that you can all hear me okay. Alexandra, welcome. The hedgehog is here, everybody. That's a big deal. So glad to have you join. Holly, I'm glad that you're excited about joining into the show. Don't worry, you're not gonna appear on camera or anything but I've got to celebrate you appropriately. Alexandra, I'm so glad you were able to make it. Welcome. Appreciate everyone's support. As you know, I continue to try to build the channel and uh, getting used to all of this here, not only in the studio, but actually out online as well. So I'm just gonna ask one more time. Um, is the music too loud and can you hear my voice okay? Is it a nice balance? Holly says good. That makes me feel good. Been trying to perfect this. Again, you'll have to forgive me if I look off to uh, the side there. It's just that's where your comments are. Um, I have not figured out how to get those onto this computer. So that's super fun. Penny, that's great. Great news. That's good news. That's good news. And you know, it's one of those things where you um, have to think about um, seeing your comments and also wearing the glasses for up close, but you can't see the comments from far away. Goodness. So Greg made you a cocktail. What did Greg make you, Alexandra? What was, what was, what was the um, cocktail of choice? What is everybody drinking tonight? No, thank you. That is good to know, because I'm going to want to know. Music is a bit loud, says Penny. All right, so we've got some competing thought there. Music is on a different, um, a, a different mouse, which is always fun to get the brain to comprehend. Okay, I can do that. So Penny, I pulled it down, hoping that that will help just a little bit. Marie, welcome to the show. Glad you're here. Welcome to Craft Cocktails. So glad to have everybody. Music is a tad bit loud, so I'm going to pull it down one more time to see if that can be reduced just a little bit. As I had mentioned before, I know that the music is always a constant debate for everybody, but for me, it just kind of keeps the energy flowing and uh, feels good. So that's why I really want to try to keep it into the show. To my ears, the music is a bit loud. I can hear you fine, though. The drinking plain ginger ale. You know what, Carol? I am actually obsessed with ginger ale. Um, I love it, so I think that that is just great. All right, so I pulled the music down even better, so I'm hoping that that will help uh, a little bit as well. So, um, so glad that everyone's here. Uh, let's see how we're doing. We've got um, 27 people in the room, which is good. 
So um, tell me how, Marie, how do you both know each other? What What, what is the um, connection there? And how are you and your husband? It feels like forever since creativation. Amanda, so glad that you're here as well. Tonight we're going to be uh, going to a, down to a brand new all to new um, craft mat as well, which I'm excited about as well. So I just wanted to give another plug. I know Alexandra, you had requested. I'm actually waiting to hear from um, Ashley Cornell. Um, if you'd like to join via Skype, um, I just need to talk to you a little bit offline and then we can throw it to you and you can come into the show um, and we can say hi that way, which is great. Skype and um, it was much easier in Instagram because Instagram did it for us. Um, but for me, this is what it is. I've got to use Skype with this uh, new program that I'm doing, which is why we're here. All right, since so many people are in the room um, and I don't want to waste anybody's time, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what I'm going to do first. I am so excited and so honored to be getting so much fun mail from you all. So I thought it would be cool if we had a little mail call. Does that sound good? So Marie and I hang out on a Handmade Happiness Facebook group. Um, do I need to be part of the Handmade Happiness Facebook group? I need to know all about that. So if that's something I need to know about, you need to invite me. Amy, so glad that you're here. Welcome to the show. Always appreciate you joining. And of course, I appreciate your support on Instagram. I know. But you know what? Here's the thing. Well, I actually don't know that, but I can only imagine. So many travel plans are on hold. And I just want to remind everybody that we've just got to keep diligent and know that uh, we got to travel. We got to, we got to be brave enough to travel when it's time, you know? All right. I'm going to do one more thing to get a little bit better sound, and that is to lift my microphone. So stand by for just a second. Let me lift this baby up just a little bit more so you have me. Whoops, that bumped the sound up just a little bit. All right. All right, and I need to know about Alexandra's event. Alexandra, we clearly have got a lot of stuff we need to talk about. We have a lot of stuff we need to talk about. Um, all right, so shall we go ahead and go to mail call since um, a lot of you are here in the room? Um, I think that'd be fun, right? I always love to show off great handmade kindness is coming my way and um, have a new desktop so um, hey Simon how are you always good to have Simon Hurley in the room um, again not only a dude crafter had a big week himself by the way um, but so supportive if you guys want to know um, a friend that looks out for me that's Simon Hurley and uh, he is definitely always thinking of other people um, you need to check out his newest video where he embraces as well as uh, Bridges, um, TikTok, the social media platform, with crafting, which is super exciting. Hazel Harper just came up and scared me to death, but that's fine. She's not typically a dog that sneaks up on you, but she did. Oh, Mama Joanne is here. Hi, Mama, how are you? The matriarch of us all. Hope you're doing well. Hope Lonnie is doing well. I gotta tell you, that pool, you showed the other day I was like that's the one thing I'm missing from my quarantine is the ability to be swimming in a pool but we're still pretty lucky which I'm I'm glad so as you know if a dude enters the room that's a crafter you gotta uh, throw up hashtag dudes craft too so type that up and send that up on the board I would appreciate it we always appreciate uh, dudes that craft too and uh, Kel so glad that you're here welcome I didn't catch your comment right away so glad to have you join us welcome 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 Oh, uh, Simon, yes, uh, I do. I love TikTok as well. And there's that great debate, of course, of whether we're all getting our information stolen from a foreign country, but that's actually been a little bit debunked, everybody. So kind of make sure that we do our research, right, before we just promote things on um, social media that's actually against social media, you know? 
All right, so Ashley, I don't think, has tuned in to join yet, so we're not going to focus on her. Again, everyone, welcome to Craft Cocktails. If you don't already subscribe, I would really appreciate the subscription. As you can imagine, as I'm a fledgling channel, any subscribing, commenting, and liking that you do on my channel just helps me out so much. So if you could help a brother out, especially one that is currently furloughed from his job, I would appreciate that. Marie, thanks for playing along. Karen, welcome. So glad to have you in the show. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ashley, welcome. How are you? Good to see you. Um, yes, the pool. I'm telling you, Joanne, it's the one thing. Oh, can you imagine? At Mama Joe's house. Joanne would have food. Lonnie would be making us laugh. And we would craft. I mean, that's fantastic. Pat, welcome to the show. We're so glad that you're here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Cindy Ellen, yay, I'm glad you're here. Up, uh, the preacher's in the house. Send us to church, brother. How are you doing? Your stuff lately, Daniel, has been amazing. Good job, buddy boy. Julie, thanks for throwing that up. That's appreciated. Thank you for a big thumbs up. Again, Wendy, Wendy's got it right. That's the way to support and like a channel. All right. Um, Daniel's here. The real party has started because Daniel's here. All right. Um, like I said, I don't think Ashley can join. We're going to throw down to the desktop now. This is a new surface because we were getting so much glare. Um, but I think I'm going to switch to the black side. You know, this is an all to new um, self repairing map. I, of course, love my uh, Tim Holtz uh, glass mat, and I definitely will keep it. Um, Oh, Mama Joe, I forgot that you are a good cocktailier, too. I forgot about that. Chris O'Wiley, welcome, welcome, welcome. Chris, o, I've got to get you on um, private reserve. We need to talk about that. Um, absolutely, Chris. Um, all right, so um, yeah, I'm trying the new, uh, not the new, the, uh, the, the, old, the old friend, the Alta New Craft Mac. Uh, just so it would help with the glare. I might switch to the black side eventually, which is good. Um, Daniel's here, as I said, and so that's another Dude's Craft 2. So if y'all could throw that up. I need to make a little um, Dude's Craft 2 um, lower third Chiron for that, I think, is what I need to do. I'm going to do it. I'm going to try to work on it this week, everybody. I'm going to try to figure out a way to um, get better lower thirds what they say in television where on the screen you could do like a half triangle that's sort of semi-transparent with a lot of information and not have to rely on this which is it the problem with this is that it looks like a hot button that you can click and so you actually can't so um all right hi philip so glad that you're here welcome brother glad you're here hi linnell oh my favorite linnell so kind to me, always so appreciative. Karen knows everybody in the chat. All right, let's go ahead and get back to the desktop. So we are going to do a classic mail call. Look at all the mail that we have to open. And I'm gonna to try to be good and cover up your address. Um, so let's, let's get to it, if you will. If you would like to send me mail, I will always appreciate some mail, which is a favorite of mine. Let's go ahead and start because I know she's here in the room with the lovely Jules, Julie, Julie, Julie. Julie, uh, of course, is with Old Stonehouse Crafts. You can catch her at jmitch21397 at gmail.com. And of course, uh, Jules, be sure to throw up Old Stonehouse Crafts uh, where they can find you here in, the, um, in both YouTube as well as on Instagram. All right, so what I loved about this, two things. First of all, some, some of these I'm gonna open on camera. Some of them that I am opening, um, I've already opened because I just couldn't wait. Uh, so what I love is that Miss Julie, who constantly uh, does great connection with me offline, um, wanted to know that she was inspired to use this Pink Fresh Studio set and she wanted to use it in her own way. So she sent me a lovely little note, but then she just wanted to remind us of all of the um, types of um, products she used, which is on there a little harder. So this is, of course is the Avery um, stamp set. Line art is by Altenew, which is the sentiment. Jewels are Pink Fresh Studios. The card base is 120 pounds. Simon says stamp white. Nice 
and uh, uh, weight to it, which is great. And scraps and dies from Stampin' Up. Captain Cooler Blue suede shoes ink for the background, Versafine Black, and Jelly Roll White for some of the additions, which is fantastic. Uh, so what I love about this one, and again, sadly I'm not able to see all the comments when I'm, I'm on the desktop, so forgive me. What I love about this is that it just has such a great pattern to it, a nice shimmer, all the jewels seem to connect, blues look fantastic, the red and combinations are fantastic. So Julie, thank you so much for this. And that's a gorgeous stamp too, by the way, look at that stamp. So Julie, there you go. Thanks for this card, fantastic. And I'm glad that I inspired you to use that as well. All right, so Tana, I don't think is in the room unless I missed her on the feed. Tana, are you here? Let's see. Thanks for all the dudes craft too. Um, Catherine Cooler, come here. Gail, oh, okay. Gail, that's so sweet. I'm glad that you um, are, are excited to be back. I'm, I'm glad to be back as well. Um, so, Philip, I'm glad that you're, this music is so cheesy, but it's copyright free, so what am I going to do? Alright, so Tana sent me a belated birthday card in some beautiful blue and red nautical stripes. Great coloring. It's a shaker card, and we love a good shaker card. So fun and fantastic. Great utilization of colors from Tana. And double lined. I do love when we use a card base and then we add an addi additional um, panel on the back. I think it just ups up the elegance of it and of course it helps with its durability and stability on the table when we double line. So I never, uh, send, I never not send out two lines here or two uh, layers here. Um, so great weight to this card, which is so important to me. So way to go, Tana. Tana, thank you so much for that. So good job, Tana Low House. Okay. Moving right along with mail call, everybody. Next up, she's here online with me, the lovely Holly. Holly, thank you so much um, for your... Oh, Holly, stand by. Can I just say one thing, um, Miss Julie? Julie, on your card, I so appreciated the tie-in of the um, filigreed IV from the Avery stamp set on the envelope. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. I agree, Cindy Ellen. I agree. All right, so Holly, I'm so sorry to steal the spotlight from you back. This is an adorable card with so many techniques used in one. Um, everything from an amazing embossing to a strong um, strip. This strip, what I love about this is that it is so um, weighted perfectly that it actually looks more um, high-end than I bet it, it really is. Like the way that it balances out the car is fantastic. Simple use of white space and such beautiful background texture. Look at that. Completely ties it all in, which is fantastic. Michelle, welcome. So glad that you're here. All right. Uh, be kind to yourself. Breathe in, breathe out, and let that shiitake go. What I love about Holly here is that she knew that I was getting a little frustrated, and she sent me a great message. So all the way from Kentucky, I'm so appreciative of this card. Holly's online with us, so be sure to celebrate Holly. Uh, she joins us uh, tonight as well. All right. How are we doing on the sound? Are we doing well? You guys hearing me okay? Music balanced out okay? And this weird song that's playing right now. All right, let me see if I can jump back to my first cam real quick. All right, good. You know what? We get a Krissa Wiley stamp of approval. Krissa, you didn't argue with me online, but you were saying that maybe I was giving you credit where I shouldn't have, and that was to be the fantastic ink blender that you are. I think that your ability to have faint but significant focus and your clouds around your um, focal points of ink blending, I don't know what that's called, I'm sure there's some technical term, is fantastic. So, all right, we're getting, sound is great, which is good. Julie, did you love that your card was featured? It was fantastic. All right, we're gonna have to move this music along because it's just a little too, I don't know. I've gotta get a, my own 
playlist on here. Spotify does an epidemic um, sound, which is one of the companies that I use in order to have um, copyright free music on YouTube. Because as Simon, the 17 year old prophet that he is, reminded me is that I don't want to get any copyright um, zingers. So that's why you have this weird music that no one's heard of playing in the background, which is so. Um, Chrissa, please. Chrissa. I mean, blush all you want. Blushing looks good on us redheads. It does. It does. Um, Florida Crafty Girl, do I know you by another name? I don't know you. And by the way, you really haven't missed anything. We've just been chatting. We've been having a little drink. We've been doing mail call. We're going to get ready to go back to mail call. Yeah, see, Wendy, I agree. Carissa has got the ink blending down. Um, hey, Simon, are you still in the room or did you have to jet? If Simon's here, I want to give him just one more love. You would think that he pays me. He really doesn't pay me. But I have a comment to make, Simon Hurley. Oh, Michelle. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad, I'm glad. Uh, shall we get back to roll call while we wait to see if Simon's here? Or roll call. Everybody, please sound off. I'm just kidding. Amanda Panda, so glad that you're here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, um, Christina, you can't go anywhere. You, you were gonna be the finale of Mail Call because you totally do Mail Call on your channel, so I totally stole it from you. Um, but since you're here and I don't want you to run away, two things. First of all, can you Skype in or are you super busy and not camera ready? It is Mother's Day. Simon is still here. Christina, think about that. Stand by. I'm about to throw to the desktop and you're going to be featured. So don't go anywhere, even if you're super busy. Um, really quick, the reason that I called to make sure that Simon was back is because I just want to give a quick shout out. So I'm currently um, doing online card classes for Christina and Jennifer. And it has been super fun to do. I'm always really appreciative that those ladies asked me to join. And they're doing a really fun uh, series of classes and we get to stay with the class um, if we're featured and um, I've got to tell you it's been a blast to learn some techniques so much so that I was actually going to try one of them tonight on the show but I thought mm, you gotta pay for the class and join the class in order to do those techniques so now this is weird music too I feel like we're in a club that we shouldn't be in like it's dark and scary Let's just bop this song and we can get that song ahead. Um, so, uh, back on track, Jeff, back on track. My technique is gonna be featured in a couple weeks, maybe next week, I'm not quite sure. I'm not into those details. Um, in any case, um, I was featured in a topic that we all know well, color blocking. And so um, I didn't really get the color blocking right away. And as you can imagine, one of the better ways to color block is to ink blend and that's the reason why i was frustrated yesterday is because my deadline for online card classes holly it is i'm so glad that i get to what is it when you're not paying for college but you get to sit in the class i forgot what it's called christina it did it sounded like we were in like a dark back area of a club that didn't get necessarily sanctioned by the government um I don't know, it's the cocktails talking. Uh, in any case, um, I was getting so frustrated. And you were also supportive, so thank you so much for that. But what I found was, is that Simon just reminded me, he was like, brother, you need to remember that my inks and my paper are a deadly combination that are fantastic. So I just want to give a small shout out to Ranger Ink, Simon Hurley Create, his colors, blend so perfectly on his stark white paper that I finished the project and I think gave my best card, which totally can't show you because you got to go to online card classes in order to see it, which is worth the value, by the way. If I had pre-thought about it, audit the class. That's what it is, Christina. Thank you very much. Yes. So we get to audit the class if we're a featured designer. And so I'm totally auditing the classes and completely doing all the things, which is fantastic. I just saw my face on the camera and I need to stop eating the bread that Dan is giving us. Okay, so um, 
So I am sweet, Simon. You should know that. I'm a very sweet person. Very kind. But I want to remind everybody that it it blends so well and you use some picket fence um, life-changing blending tools and you are ready to go. Um, online card classes are the best. Being asked to be one of the guest artists is one of my secret crafty wishes. Michelle put it into the universe and it shall happen. It shall happen. They're actually doing a really cool thing right now where they take um, designers that have actually accomplished a lot with a long career and a lot of strong techniques as well as ability to teach and they are asking us to come in and kind of demonstrate what the professor just taught us and that's another term christina what's that when you um when you are the like assistant to the professor we're totally doing that and so i am featured with the amazing Lori wilson who is doing color blocking as well and her card looks fantastic again we can't show you it's very top secret you've got to go online and see it um yes totally loving the classes and you know here's the thing about online card classes is that you know the more that i've started to do this jeff Lindbergh creates thing and starting to build things by myself i have this um real appreciation for the professionalism that's put on the back end everything from copywriters who look at the scripts that they're saying to the way that christina runs the technology to how they work with us um, I just have to tell you that it has just been such a professional experience. This is my um, second time doing it as well. Um, yes, Mama Joanne says she fully endorses, which is great. Teacher's assistant? I don't know if it was a teacher's assistant. It's something where you PA? I don't know. Carol, I'm so glad that you just got his card stock. Uh, he is also now doing a value pack. Uh, with Ranger where there's a multiple amount of paper which you will go through it like crazy and again it um, does great. Uh, yes, Simon, is that for Simon? Cindy Ellen? He's got some more oranges and you never know he could be he's always working he's always and they always surprise us with the release they release more this week um, from landscape scenes to uh, more um, of a sports feel which totally don't know about with the sports ball Simon, we forgot to talk about that, but you were very excited about the sports, so I guess I have to be excited about it as well. All right. Um, Christina Werner thinks I'm the best. All right, since because Christina Werner thinks I'm the best, I was going to save. Do you see in the stack? Oh, it would help if I switched cameras. Um, okay. Okay. In the stack, look what was on the very back. She was my finale, but because she's in the room, um, we're going to go with it. Okay. When you get a Christina Werner card, you know it. Look at that. I can't even handle it. Um, but yeah. Christina. Oh my gosh. Um, and then... There is her address, so we'll hide that just in case she doesn't want that exposed. I didn't get her permission. Um, okay, I'm going to open it on air. Christina sends me a lot of cash, so let me take the cash out first, and then I will show you the card. Oh, you know what? I was wondering if this was gonna happen, and it totally did. When you watch the videos, um, I didn't, I didn't, I covered it, I, I, I didn't, but, okay, back to that, but I covered it. The best part here is when you see this card being made and you wonder, hmm, I wonder if, um, okay, totally, um, go be with fam. Be sure to check out Simon's latest video, uh, he enjoys TikTok hacks and it's enjoyable. Um, Ashley, you said you wanted to come online. Would you like to join me? I haven't been able to, um, I sent you a text. Okay, let's get back to Christina's card. Christina did this one on her YouTube channel, so be sure to check it out. Uh, showcases not only um, one of my favorite techniques, which is the splatter technique, but also how you can build dimensions. Uh, she flips this stamp around to use it several ways, which is fantastic. Um, I will read this sentiment later. 
Um, but look at our girl. The other thing that I love about Christina is that she is not an A2 girl. She will do a big ass card, which I love. So thank you so much. And thanks so much for the cash. This was a very generous amount of money. So thank you very much. That's right, everybody. Be sure to send me lots of dollars and please try to send more than Christina does. Um, she sends a lot, which is fantastic. Oh, Christina. Um, hi, hey, everybody. Jake's on. Jake, cheers. It's a simple night. We're just doing vodka and uh, Tito's specifically and a Sprite and a fresh squeezed lime. Um, nothing fancy. Um, okay, Ashley, way to get my hopes up that you're going to be able to join and you're clearly not. Um, so everyone be sure to go check out, check out Jake. He is also on YouTube and he is featured on Instagram. Um, as you know, I always joke that, um, he is very pretty to look at, um, but also fun, super fun personality, as well as a super exciting channel himself. Um, he premieres new videos on Tuesdays, so be sure to check him out as well. Jake, thanks so much for stopping by. Um, five by seven cards from Miss Christina. She is over her A2 days, everybody. She's ready to go big or go home, which is good. It is a big ass card, I agree. Um, Christina does not hand out cash to just everybody. She hands it out to me because I'm her favorite. Um, let's see, I wish I could go right now and text her to get back. Okay, well hopefully you can join, which is great. Um, yeah, Carissa, please. I'm always happy to ride. At Jeff Lindbergh Creates. You can send as much cash as you all want. I'm broke and currently unemployed. And if anyone knows anything about the state of Florida, I may not ever get paid, ever. We don't talk about politics on the show, but I don't care what side of the aisle you're on, the state of Florida is embarrassing. Okay, uh, let's get back to the cards, everybody. All right, next up, with her brand new logo, Mindy Egan, Mindy Egan Designs. Unbelievable, um, beautiful, um, look at that. Ombre, but Mindy Egan. You can check her out at Mindy Egan Designs, and of course she's on Instagram as well, which is fantastic. I know your background just gets unbelievable big. Okay, I don't think Dana's on tonight. Uh, but Dana, of course, my friend from Tampa, who we all love, you can follow Dana Joy, not only for her cocktails herself, but her YouTube channel is MZ Dana Joy and Instagram at MZ Dana Joy as well. And uh, gotjoycreations.com. So this is beautiful. Yes, but you're feeling it remotely and probably seeing other portions of the world and know how um, Indiana probably has got their act together and we don't. Okay, uh, this is from Michelle, the owner of, um, of course, one of the newer companies, Pink and Main, that I've worked with. I'm super excited about them. They are, of course, part of the Stamping Village and have been so supportive of me. Um, and so she sent me a bunch of her uh, sets. But Michelle, um, all of these from her, um, uh, oh my gosh, topiary? I'm forgetting the word. Um, the diamond back plaid, as well as uh, the cutouts. And of course, a lot of craft paper use. Craft paper is super in right now. Okay, Renee, let me see if I can fix the music for you. I don't want the music to be distracting. Stand by bring the music down a little bit. Renee, let me know if um, that helps a little bit. I do want to keep it in the background, so just to keep your feedback up, which should be great. Um, you are more than welcome to DM me, and I will uh, share my address with you there. So that's mail call, everybody. Uh, I thought this was a fantastic array of cards. I'm, oh, you know what? I have another one to show up. Let's see if she comes up. Um, Madeline Ong is um, going to... I have one to open for her, but let's see if she shows up and we'll open it live on air. Um, so, unbelievable. Christina's big ass card, which is great. Holly, 
gotta get me some Julie over here, Tana. Wait, where did we? Oh, what did we do with your card? Okay, there we go. So those are mail calls for today, which is great. Renee, did that sound come down perfect? Are you good? Just wanna make sure. That's awesome. All right. That's mail call. How are we doing? 40 minutes. That took 40 minutes of chatting and we haven't made one thing yet. Is that good or bad? Terrarium. There's the word. Terrarium. That one was difficult for me. Gail, I agree. I agree. Um, friends, we haven't made anything. <laughs> And we've already been on 40 minutes. Um, but that's fine. Hi, Pat. Yes, I thought they were wonderful as well. Um, yeah, we haven't made one thing. And I wanted us to make something tonight, which... Hello. Let's get hopping. Um, shall we? Shall we go for it? All right. So what I thought I would do tonight is, well, first of all, I didn't plan for anything, which is never good, because, you know, I should be a little bit more organized. Um, but what I thought I would do tonight is I thought that we would use a Simon, Seb blah, blah, a Simon Says Stamp collaboration set with a stamp market, because I got some new Altenew inks that I wanted to try. And so, I don't know, I thought maybe we'd go for it. I thought we were going to have Ash, but Ash couldn't join us. Um, this is my quick plug. Again, if you haven't seen Callie Person or Ashley Cornell's uh, Craft Cocktails, The Private Reserve, I'd appreciate you checking it out. Um, watching it all, all the way through always helps me, which uh, is fantastic. Again, um, no shame in my game, currently unemployed. Anything you can do to help support means the world to me. Um, it's just the state of the world that we're in right now. So I'll help you, you help me. Watch my videos, it means the world. Uh, comment, subscribe, and like, and of course I'll comment back and uh, we can get connecting that way. Um, as you can imagine, virtual connections are almost as good as in-person connections and they do um, help me in this really kind of awkward time for me, which is unfortunate. So, yeah. All right. Um, so let's go back down to the desktop. And um, this was the stamp set that I was going to try to use tonight. Um, this is, um, well, actually, I don't know if they're new. They're new to me. So let's be clear. I should change my nomenclature. All right. So the Stamp Market, Simon Says Stamp Collab. This is the Just Because stamp set. Love the floral. And these are the two new Altenew inks. First of all, of course, I got the new Altenew pad. Um, that's, again, new to me. This is not new. It's self-repairing. I thought that would help with some of the glare issues that I've been having with the camera. So uh, that's fantastic. Um, so, uh, yeah. So, yes, thank you so much for watching, uh, Callie, as well as um, uh, uh, Ashley. So your private reserve videos have been great. Love the format and getting to know. Thank you so much. Oh, I got a thumbs down. Boo. I wonder who just gave me a thumbs down. That's gross. Um, totally leave then. Sorry, still not used to people that are giving thumbs down. Let's hope that was an accident. Um, okay. So these are the two uh, new Altenew uh, inks. Again, I need to stop saying new because it, they're probably not new. They're new to me. I just got them. I ordered them from Simon Says Stamp. Simon Says Stamp is now shipping. So I bought this Alter New Craft Mat, uh, two-sided black as well as this gray. And then uh, the Alter New Anti Gold Pigment Ink. It's a metallic gold uh, that can be used um, on uh, adding a touch of shimmer or shine to projects. It, uh, slower drying time, it allows for the addition of clear embossing powder. Um, which is fantastic. I didn't know that I could add clear embossing powder, which is great. Um, and then this one is the rich and vibrant um, enchanted gold, which let's see if we can add. Dries quickly and will not fade. All right. So there you go. Let's keep those on camera. 
Um, let's see what Ashley has to say. Ashley will know. Okay, so, oh yes, the gold pigment inks are the best. Do it, you'll not regret. Do it meaning uh, don't uh, totally emboss it. Emboss it and we'll love it. Yeah, Michelle, I agree. Who the F just gave me a thumbs down on my live? Holly, I agree. I didn't know either. And what I love and what I wanted to show is that it kind of helps with the quick sentiment making, which is something that I've kind of been struggling with right now is um, using sentiments. Um, sentiments to me are um, easy to make. I get it. We just stamp either on a white or black background or color that matches your card base and then you emboss a sentiment. Like that part is fine. For me, it's cutting the strip um, in the perfect position. Um, and I know there's plenty of tools out there, um, but uh, I just haven't been very successful with them. I've never even needed to. So she's saying, look, just stamp with it, move on with your life. Okay, um, let's do it then. Let's jump over to that and let's um, jump over to the Simon Says Say It All Friends stamp set. It would help if I was on that camera so that y'all could see what I was talking about. Um, that's true. Thank you for that. Uh, do I need to rethink the other often greetings? Do we need to re-ink them often? Leonardo, that's a great question. Let's hope Ashley can answer that for us. I use the black pigment ink from Altenew all the time and emboss with them. Okay. I love the black paper and white emboss mounting less flakes. Okay. All right. So the reason that I'm excited about picking this, first of all, this is some of the most lovely sentiments, so endearing, um, but they are unbelievably supportive for what's going on right now. But I am loving how these handle on black and other colors. So I thought that we would give it a try. So let's do that. Um, let me make sure that I'm caught up on the comments really quick. I am perfect. Maybe we'll come back to the stamp market. Let's try these two inks. Let's make some sentiments, shall we? All right, so um, I did have some black cardstock ready to go. Um, okay, I wish that the coloration was a little bit better. Hi, Nina Marie. Welcome. Welcome, friend. Nina Marie can also be found in online card classes and, uh, of course, for the Simon Says Stamp channel. Um, but what we love about Nina Marie is that she produces great content quickly, concisely, and always helps us think outside of the box, which is fantastic. Um, so Nina Marie has Simon Says Stamp videos as well as online card classes, and uh, so it's been great to watch her techniques. Okay, so what we wanted to do is let me jump back onto this camera really quick. We wanted to uh, kind of step up our sentiment game just a little bit. Again, this is the Say It All Friend stamp from Stamp Set. And again, what I love about these is that they are unbelievable, great sentiments, sorry for the reflection, but they are deeply meaningful. They uh, are very purposeful in how they were written, uh, which is fantastic. Um, so uh, you give me a thousand reasons to laugh and smile, but best of all, you give me a million memories that I'll never forget. I mean, the writing is just so fantastic. Um, so the reason I wanted to challenge with this set is because I wanted to make sure that uh, texting such small letters, which can be kind of intimidating, would hold up pretty well. So let's play with these for just a few minutes and see how they do. Um, so great. All right. Let's first of all do a chunkier sentiment. You know, I love a good chunky sentiment. Um, and this, uh, thankful for you, let's try it. Nina, is this your stamp set? How ironic if it is. Nina, we gotta talk about this if this is yours because the kismet of the fact that you're on right when I'm talking about this stamp set Oh my gosh, friend, I did not know that and I still mean what I just said. These verb, the verbiage in these are so unbelievably kind and personal, they kind of make me emotional. And the reason that I'm saying that is I think that of course we're in a very, and there's no way that y'all are seeing that very well, I'm sorry. Um, this is the, um, let me, Amanda, let me get your comment up there. 
This is the Say It All Friend um, sentiment stamp set, which is great. I know that the camera is not going to pick those up very well. Um, the danger, the danger of um, the danger of uh, trying. Let me see if I can do two screens. Uh, the danger of trying to get small verbiage on camera, which is great. But check them out online at Simon Stamps. Simon says stamp. And again, it is the Say It All Friend stamp set. And uh, yeah, we love supporting Nina. Nina, that's so funny that you're on. I promise I didn't know that, but now you do. Okay, so we're gonna take the thankful for you. Great scripting on this. A perfect, it's sort of chunky, but it's um, not too big. Um, which one would y'all like to see first? Amanda, I, I agree. I love it too. Again, I just got these. Um, I got these two stamp sets and the mat from Simon Says Stamp. They are currently shipping. Um, which one would you like to try? The Ultimate Metallic Gold, that's this antique gold, or the Enchanted Gold on the black? Let's stamp our first one. As you know, with Craft Cocktails, you get to choose. Which one do you all want to see first? Let us know, do you want to see the antique gold or the enchanted gold? Which looks like it's uh, reading a little bit darker. Gold? <laughs> Wendy, I think they're both gold, friend. They are, yeah, they're both gold. That's, that's not gonna help me. All right, I'm gonna pick for us. I'm gonna use the antique gold. All right, on black cardstock, this is Simon Says Stamp, black, black. We've got the antique gold. The antique gold is, okay, perfect. So I'm glad that I'm using that one. Um, so this is Simon Says Stamp cardstock. This is black, black. And I can already tell I'm obsessed. We have a nice, So I could have put this in the Misty, which in case this doesn't go well, we can switch over to the Misty. Penny, I agree. We've got to use both anyway. Maybe we should do that. All right, this is just one impression of the antique gold. It's great. Um, let's go ahead and wipe this one down really quick. I think that the mica, is that what it's called, is going to stick on this. This is the um, Picket Fence Studios uh, stamp cleaner. Carol, we're going to have to um, we're going to have to say that loud so we can get Miss Nina Marie on it, right? Right, let's just make sure that that's nice and clean so we can compare the two. So this was the Altenew Antique Gold Pigment Ink. Great, stamp that out really quick. And it did come off pretty well actually. Um, and let's move over to the Enchanted Gold and compare the two. That's right, so uh, let's throw that comment up really quick from Nina. Um, that if you want the Simon Says Stamp, we'll email you uh, with details of when the shipment comes in for them to send out to you. Oh, Michelle, that scrubby has been great. I got a free sample of it in uh, Creativation. All right, so we're gonna move over to the Enchanted Gold. Linnell, um, thanks for asking. Um, I store it in that thing that was really popular. Um, this is uh, that sponge holder. Oh, Michelle, is there something weird that happens? All right, so this is the Enchanted Gold, and the Enchanted Gold does um, not have the same heavy um, 
pigmentation behind it. It's a little uh, more translucent. Um, still looks great, but it looks almost like um, I didn't get a good stamp, which is great. Hey guys, Andy's here. Dude Crafters are here, so we know when Dude Crafters into the room. That's a hashtag DudesCraft2 up on the board. I appreciate it. Peggy. Thank goodness Simon is shipping again. You need to spend that $100 gift card. If y'all could have seen the amount of money that um, that Christina just sent me in her envelope, you would know that I'm probably going to go shopping too. It's a salt holder. Yes, Amanda. Thank you. All right. So uh, that is what a larger sentiment looks like. Again, clearly the enchanted gold is a little more translucent. I've got to get the lighting better here, friends. We'll work on it. We'll work on it. All right. So a little bit more translucent. And then this one uh, still uh, came out pretty great, which is fantastic. All right. Thanks for the dude's craft, too. We appreciate that. Andy uh, clearly has not watched the um, videos that I'm still promoting. Um, Andy, you either haven't told me that you've watched a video, but I have a feeling that you haven't because you would have said something if you did. Don't, if anybody knows what I'm referring to for Andy Granick, then don't tell him. But if he had watched the videos, he would have said something to me, but she hasn't. Um, I'm just saying, Christina, money is money, and I don't want you to be too humble about your generosity, but I appreciate you sending me so much cash, which is fantastic. Anybody else who wants to send me cash or my Venmo, happy to support. Tip your host, everybody. Tip your host. Um, okay. It's, yeah, it's real money. It's real money, you guys. Um, all right, let's go back down to the... Ugh, again, I hate it, when, hate it when the DJ puts on a song that's just too much. Okay, now let's move back over to Nina's stamp, and let's do uh, two things. Let's do a larger um, one with a lot of carriage returns, and then let's do a one-liner. Uh, so... Um, you're a fighter and nothing can ever hold you back. Always remember that. Oh my lord, these make me so emotional. It's the alcohol and it's the um, pandemic clips that we're in, everybody. Emotional at a drop of a hat. All right. You can tell I was already playing with that stamp set. Let's clean this up really quick. Kathy Zilski is here, everybody. Hey, Mama. So glad that you're here. Um, yes, of course you tipped me, Christina. Thank you so much, which is fantastic. CZ, I'm so glad that you're here. Um, we were just promoting online card classes. Let me jump back to this camera really quick. Let me give some um, love to my Kathy Zilski really quickly. First of all, I was uh, bragging on Simon when he was in the room. Let me brag on Kathy Zilski. Uh, Kathy has been unbelievably supportive, just like Christina. Christina started this whole thing, by the way. So if you want to know where this came from, this is the person who gave me a thumbs down, by the way. Blame Christina Werner. She's the one that discovered me and connected me with all of you all. So, um, and now she's paying me with a lot of cash. Um, in any case, uh, what I wanted to share was online card classes features the likes of, of course, owned and operated by Christina, features Christina day one, goes right into some Kathy Zilski, whose 10 minute design chant, design chants, where she just sits in the, just, she sits in a circle and chants with Indian music playing behind her um, and does meditation. No, 10 minute design for crap, for designers. In any case, the reason that I'm going here, this is a little bit of the vodka talking. Uh, the reason that I'm super excited about it is because first of all, she holds to her 10 minutes. It's on Facebook. Her lighting is fantastic. It doesn't, it looks so much better than this. Uh, her audio levels are delish. 
um, she interacts and she has a topic and the topics are always things that I've always wanted to ask her. So you talk about, um, you know, how online card classes is getting you connected with some of these great designers. What I love is that Kathy is providing you quick lessons that help progress the dialogue about creativity. So be sure to jump over to her Facebook page and see when her next chat is coming up, which is fantastic. Um, the reason that I am, um, um, I think if there's anybody that could do it, CZ could do it. Um, but anyway, back to online card classes. Uh, Nina Marie um, is uh, currently teaching and again my episode is coming up soon so be sure to check out online car classes space is still available and again as I said earlier in the episode unbelievable professionalism unbelievable connection to its students and uh, the archive ability of you getting these classes is so much more than just YouTube tutorials uh, so fantastic so I just want to throw this up um, again, it's 10 minute design chats for crafty people. Um, and I just want to say that um, CZ can't even say it in her own show. So it's okay that I, as the person who's not the host of that show, cannot say it quickly. Um, but yeah, they are fantastic. And again, it's getting inside tips when you have wanted to kind of get this information, but Kathy can't spend her entire um time in her social media background running the business that she can on the topic that you want to hear about. So I love that these are small um, kind of edible bites that help you kind of uh, forget the uh, forget the day, tune in for 10 minutes, typically around lunchtime on Eastern um, border, um, which has been great. Okay, uh, Nina Marie, I'm just the sidecar. Mine is the Lori Willison episode. It's fantastic. Um, but I'm just the sidecar, which I have to find, who was your sidecar? Who was your person? Um, yeah, Kathy can't say it either, so you can't all judge me. Shall we get back to the desktop and then let's wrap it up? Let's wrap it up after we uh, finish our little project here. All right, let's get the desktop back up. Um, all right, so now what we're doing is we're back to that black card stock. We're going to take one of the uh, sentiments and see how this um, Altenew ink does with smaller fonts. Sound good? Yes, and her digital art designs are coming back. She is archiving and working on them now, and she's gonna bring them to us soon. All right, we're gonna jump back over to that antique, um, I'm sorry, let's go back with the Enchanted Gold. Um, which uh, tended to do pretty damn well. Uh, it's, it's okay, I'm totally fine with being a sidecar. I'm owning the title. All right, I'm gonna keep this press impression light because I'm on the misty, I'm throwing that around and making a mess so I can reapply if I need to. Onlinecarclasses.com, I believe. Yay, Holly, we just featured Holly um, a second ago. All right, so um, first impression did pretty well for the smaller sentiment, which is great. I'm just gonna do another one specifically on the last couple of lines to see if I can juice that up just a little bit better. I'm gonna see if that helped. So holds pretty well, right? Which is great. Let's flip it over and let's do the antique gold. Make sure that I'm doing this right. Should be enchanted, right? Yes. Okay. Yes, it's already day five, but I can assure you that all the products are archived and you are more than welcome to join at any time. Yes, this is the new collaboration between My Sweet Petunia and Hero Arts. The owner of My Sweet Petunia got mad at me when I was making fun of the pink, so I'm not gonna comment about that, but I'm not making fun of it. I'm just saying this is a little more palatable for us dudes. 
All right, so switching over to the antique gold, we're gonna see how this one does. This one was a little more translucent just a second ago. First impression and first pass. Now, ironically, this seemed to do better with a smaller sentiment. Hmm, that could be the user. I have no comments about it other than I would like to thank Hero Arts for sending this to me. Very impressed with how that looks. That's why Ashley was saying that it holds unbelievably well. That is a nice first impression, everybody. All right, let's do a single line. Um, let's do one of the smaller ones that Nina has. Uh, be bold. Oh my gosh. Nina Marie, sister, you are a good copywriter. These are fantastic. Fantastic. All right. Kathy, it is printing really well. I was just telling everybody that, as you know, Simon is shipping, and um, I decided to try these Altenude um, uh, with the gold mica in it. And trying to step up my, um, oh, you know what? While she's in the room, let's ask her a question. Kathy Z, we need to, um, nobody told me that my collar was popped up in the back. How very 80s of me. Um, we need to chat because um, I would like just a little bit of your sentiment strips. I need I need a little reminder on how we can best cut these on a Tim Holtz tonic. I figured out how to do the large chunky ones. Those are uh, going fantastic for me. Um, and of course, I'll trim these down when I need them. Um, I have figured out, sorry, learning the camera. I have figured out how to cut these perfectly in the tonic, but CZ, we need to chat on how you line those up to get the best cut. We need to talk that because I don't want to miss. Um, I I don't want to miss uh, using those because those are super convenient. We've been talking a lot about sentiment building tonight, everybody. All right, let's go back down to the desktop and then let's go ahead and wrap this episode up. Um, so this is a two-word sentiment. We're going to switch back to the Enchanted Gold and see how that does on such a small um, stamp. First impression, not good. Bad user error. A little too much punch um, there. So let me just slide over. Let's see if I can go just a little lighter on that. Again, that was probably user error. Amy, good night, my friend. Thanks for joining. All right, so I need to get my technique down a little bit there. Let's switch over to the, so that one was the enchanted. Let's go to the antique gold for the small sentiment. exacto knife and a metal ruler that's the only way i know to and it preserves the other strips okay i need to get confident with the exacto knife hi rory so glad that you're here welcome so again i'm punching this just a little too hard and so we're getting sort of a double impression because i'm swishing So yeah, that did great as well. So what I just love about these is that, again, sorry, this is more of a lighting issue than anything, is that it quickly can take, um, it takes both embossing powder as well as just a quick print, which is fantastic. All right, let's get some of these comments up. Let's wrap the show up. Um, I had asked Kathy a way to cut down the uh, sentiment strips and she was sharing the only way to cut them was the exacto knife and the metal ruler. Because it is true, you want to hold on to the rest of those sentiments to get the best value there, which is great. 
All right. And then Laura Basson talked about it recently. I'll have to look at that. Um, Rory, well, welcome to the show. This is Craft Cocktails. We're wrapping up about over an hour. Um, so I'm going to wrap the show up. It's just me conversing, having a cocktail with you all, going live, showing products, making things. I had mail call earlier, which was fantastic. All right. Let's see what Mr. Andy says. On a wing and a prayer, Jeff, I've sacrificed a few with some user error. Uh, that's how you cut them, which is great. More importantly, sir, you need to tell me if you've watched Craft Cocktails, The Private Reserve, because I'm not going to let you be a guest unless you watched it. In episode one, I know you haven't watched yet. All right, let's see what Miss Nina Marie said. Do you have the Simon Says Stamp sentiment label dies? Those coordinate well with the sentiment strip sheets. I use those dies on my Fiskars trimmer when I cut sentiment, sentiment strips. All right, so uh, we need to look that up. So I do not, unfortunately, Miss Nina Marie, but I can always order some. Uh, Linnell, I agree. The antique gold showed up pretty well, which was great. great. Um, yes, so yeah, Nina Maria is saying that's the sure way to go, which is fantastic. Um, Miss Holly, I'm so glad that you were able, able to um, be a fellow side cardian with me. Um, I think that Laura uh, said to line up each the plastic guide on the guillotine trimmer after you cut them apart for even spacing. Gosh, I need to watch that video. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention at the time. All right, so let's see. Julie says, Rory is a friend from my local stamp group. She's great. Well, Rory, I like anybody who wants to watch me and support me, which is great. Um, you did? Hmm, I'm dragging you. And I don't know. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like that, that's not accurate. But I'm also, that could be my fault. Andy's my friend, and here I am dragging him on the show. Um, you have money now for the sentiment dies. Linnell, you're right, because I got so many tips tonight, which was fantastic. Again, my Venmo is always available. Karen, uh, thank you so much for joining, everybody. I so appreciate it. I've got to get um, our theme song queued up here, and my little channel is all messed up. So let's go ahead and pull this music out. And let's do uh, stick together, shall we? All right, friends. It's been so great hanging out. Well, this could be a little bit loud, so if it's loud, I'm sorry. If it's loud, just know it's because it's the end of it. Everybody, thanks so much for joining Cap Cocktails tonight. Thanks.